everyone, this is me again, Vincent. Welcome to a video that I guess qualifies as a theory video, but not really. But it's just an idea for a video I had, so this is kind of unusual for the channel because we're going to Saturday morning cartoons, yeah. But if you guys don't know, I like cartoons more. I like them just as much as giant monsters and other crazy things on the channel here. But we're going to talk about a cool idea about um, the old Treadmasters Godzilla um, figures, if it could have been something. Because I was looking at something this week that I just found out before that there was a series that's going to be called Operation Aliens. And basically it was um, going to be an 80s um, cartoon like Robocop and Ninja Turtles and stuff. And it was going to be based off of the old um, Kenner figures back in the day of from aliens that they um made all the kenner figures of alien and basically they um were going to do um basically before alien 3 came out they were going to do um for marketing their figures like every uh, most um cartoons like in humanoids excuse me in humanoids ninja turtles kind of thing but it was with um, different aliens taking on um, animal forms and the marines and Ripley and a reconstructed bishop um, fight the aliens and stuff kind of again like aliens but it was going to be a cartoon they had concept art they had only stills of actual a demo animation that they did and it looked and it looked cool and it would have been a great idea to make like almost like um, half again of the 80s cartoons that advertise um toys by making cartoons of the toys and that's what it w pretty much was going to be because it had um the designs and different aliens like the gorilla the flying queen and the scorpion and the crab alien like all those and it didn't happen though sadly and it would have been really cool um excuse me to see something like that because violent movies like robocop and stuff um yeah, like Robocop got their own um, Saturday cart um, 80s, 90s cartoons back in the day. But we're talking about Godzilla here, so we're going to see that, see that thing. But I already know that they done, we already have something, the Hanna-Barbera Godzilla and several other um, American shows um, back in the day with Godzilla, but they all weren't really Godzilla, like not like, um, uh, again, character wise but it kind of makes me a little upset that they didn't decide to do something like basically what they were going to do with aliens um with their treadmasters um godzilla figures like you had a few good amount of the characters um from the heisei and the classic showa era pretty much and it it kind of they have the rights to Godzilla, Treadmasters, back in the 80s, again, 90s. I've been saying it throughout this whole video. Why couldn't they try to at least get the rights from Toho and um, themselves to see, like, if they could make a cartoon to promote their toys? Because they had so many different lines, like Monster Wars and Godzilla Wars, um, Doom Island. They had so much stuff. And I even, too, own some old Treadmasters figures I had. I have a King Ghidorah, of course, that is so old. He still works amazingly. But it would have been cool, like, if it was done in the style of, like, all the other cartoons. Like, instead of, like, Zilla the series or Godzilla the series and Hanna-Barbera Godzilla back in 1978, it would have been done in the 80s, 90s with, like, flashy animation. And it would have been cool to see, like, a green, like, make them look like the figures like blue space godzilla and green godzilla and king Ghidorah. it would be cool like to um if it's not based on if they combine all their series like with the godzilla with the armor mechanized parts and all the doom island stuff with the dinosaurs like they could have turned it into a few good seasons and and it would be cool like if um mothra and gears and godzilla were the good guys or whatever and they had like the g-force people like, fight the monsters and stuff, um, flying around their ships and all that garbage. And, like, Space Godzilla was the, the 80s Skeletor or something villain, um, almost, with Biollante and, um, so, uh, several of the other monsters. But maybe Mecha Godzilla and Mecha King Ghidorah could be their own things, maybe. But it would have been really cool if they did something like this. It seems like it could have happened, like, they, 
makes sense to promote like half of the 80s cartoons were like ninja turtles they they could promote their toy lines through a child-friendly um godzilla um cartoon and it would have been cool because it would have shown more audiences godzilla back in america and it would have been really awesome but it would have been cool to include all the toys and the characters that they had um from the godzilla treadmaster line but it's just only an idea I had. I thought it'd be really cool. It, let me know if you guys agree if you like this idea. And I thoroughly hope maybe in the future some amateur, um, no, amateur filmmaker or something or some YouTuber can make a fan series or something of this, like with 2D animation and 80s style and all that good stuff. And the commercials for the Trend Masters toys were awesome anyways. But yep, so I hope you guys enjoyed this um, 80s trip for this ep um, video. So rate, comment, share, and subscribe, thumbs up, thumbs down, watch videos, hope to see you next time, and Godzilla, da, da, da. Hey guys, so if you enjoyed the video, why not check out the newest uploaded video that's on the bottom left of the screen now, or check out the previous video that's on the bottom right. And if you want to see more from me, why not click the, chan the circular ca channel icon to subscribe now. So hope you guys enjoyed, rate, comment, share, and subscribe, thumbs up, thumbs down, watch videos, and hope to see you next time, man. <laughs>